Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got x minus 1 over x equals to 7. And now we are going to find the value of x power 7 minus 1 divided by x power 7. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first thing we are going to do. Let's focus on this uh, equation. And here I have copied it down. Let's go ahead and take a square on both sides of this equation. Uh, equation let me take square on the left hand side and square on the right hand side as well and now let's recall this famous identity a minus b whole square it could be written as a square plus b square minus 2ab let's go ahead and apply this identity on the left hand side so that is going to give us x square plus 1 divided by x square minus 2 times x times 1 divided by x equals to on the right hand side 7 square is 49 and now we can see this x and 1 divided by x they cross each other out so we ended up with the x square plus 1 divided by x square minus 2 equals to 40 9. Now let's go ahead and add 2 on both sides. So this is gone. So we ended up with x square plus 1 divided by x square turns out to be 51. Now let's go ahead and take a square on both sides once again. So I'm going to take a square on this side and square on this side as well. And now let's recall this identity a plus b whole square. We are going to apply it on the left hand side of this equation. So the left hand side could be written as x square and square is going to make x power 4 plus 1 divided by x power 4 as well plus 2 times x square times 1 divided by x square equals to 51 square is same as 26, 0, 1. And now we can see that this x square and 1 divided by x square, they are gone. So we ended up with x power 4 plus 1 divided by x power 4 plus 2 equals to 26, 0, 1. And now we are going to subtract 2 from both sides. So this is gone. So therefore we are ended up with x power 4 plus 1 divided by x power 4 equals to on the right hand side 26 or 1 minus 2 is going to give us 2599. Now let me go ahead and call this as our equation number one and here's our next step let's recall this cubic identity a minus b whole cube it could be written as a cube minus b cube minus three times a b times a minus b and now somehow we want to isolate this part a cube minus b cube so therefore i am going to move this part on the other side and now we can see that a cube minus b cube has been taken care of now let's assume that our a is x and b is 1 divided by x then this equation could be written as x power 3 minus 1 divided by x power 3 equals to x minus 1 divided by x whole power 3 plus 3 times x times 1 divided by x and then times x minus 1 divided by x and now we can see this x and 1 divided by x they are gone so we ended up with simply x minus 1 divided by x whole power 3 plus 3 times x minus 1 divided by x. And now we know that x minus 1 over x equal to 7. So therefore I am going to replace this part 
x minus 1 over x by 7 and likewise this one by 7 as well. So therefore I can write 7 power 3 plus 3 times 7 and 7 power 3 is 343 plus 21. So therefore our value for x cube minus 1 divided by x cube turns out to be 364. So let me go ahead and call this as our equation number 2. And here's our final step. We wanted to calculate the value of x power 7 minus 1 divided by x power 7. And now we got these equations 1 and 2. So therefore, let's go ahead and multiply out these equations 1 and 2 now. So on the left hand side, I can write x power 4 plus 1 divided by x power 4 times x power 3 minus 1 divided by x power 3 equals to the value of x power 4 divided by 1 power x power 4 is 25.99 and then times x power 3 divided by 1 over x power 3 is 364. And now let's go ahead and multiply out these binomials by using the double distribution. So therefore, when we multiply them, we're going to get x power 7 minus 1 divided by x power 7 minus x and then plus 1 divided by x equals to and if we multiply on the right hand side we are going to get 946 0 36 and now let's go ahead and move this negative x and positive 1 over x on the other side so therefore we have x power 7 1 divided by x power 7 on the left hand side and on the right hand side we have 946 0, 3, 6. When we move these negative x on the other side become positive x and this become negative 1 over x. And now we can see that x minus 1 over x is equal to 7. So therefore the right hand side could be written as 9, 46, 0, 36 plus Seven. So therefore our x power 7 minus 1 divided by x power 7 value turns out to be, let's add these two numbers. So that is going to give us 9, 46, 0, 43. And here's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.